I urgently needed money to pay off a debt one morning and get to work before 8 a.m. Charlie, I had my ATM card, but my bank was at the other side of town. Why can't I use any ATM inside? My daughter got sick in the middle of the night and I had no cash at home to take her to the hospital. So I rushed out with my ATM card. I drove past so many ATMs because they were not my bank's ATMs. The Ghana Interbank Payment and Settlement Systems, GIPS, established by the Bank of Ghana over four years ago with the vision to transform the country's payment system, is introducing the GHLink Transaction Switching and Processing Platform. GIPS is a company set up uh, five years ago by Bank of Ghana. It's a wholly owned subsidiary of Bank of Ghana with the vision and aim to migrate Ghana into uh, an electronic payment system society. GH Link is the new electronic platform from GIPS which interconnects switches of financial institutions as well as the systems of third-party institutions. It allows banks to interoperate virtually in a seamless manner, bringing a lot of convenience to bank customers. GH Link will offer various services, the first of which is the interbank ATM transaction switching service. What GH Link is doing is it's going to connect all banks together and we're going to have a shared platform where all card holders in the country will be able to use all ATMs in the country. In so doing, availability of ATMs is going to increase and it's also going to create convenience for card holders. In considering our options for the infrastructure for this particular service, we took a look at in, um, a wide range of industry best practices and eventually selected an industry accepted um, switch that was open and acceptable to most um, financial service industries within Africa and the rest of the world. We are very confident that having implemented it exactly as has been done in the other countries, we are in the best shape to support the services within the Ghanaian industry. This service is a marked shift from the current situation where bank customers can use their local ATM cards only in the ATM of their bank, creating the inconvenience of customers roaming in search of their bank's ATMs. It even gets worse when frustrated customers walk past several functioning ATMs only to get to their bank's ATM to find it not functional. This new service therefore enables bank customers to access their bank accounts and make withdrawals from the ATMs of other banks besides that of their bank. I can use my ATM card in a different bank's ATM. You mean that you don't have to walk past a series of ATMs to get to my bank as I used to do? And I can withdraw money on any ATM here in Ghana? Wow, that's cool. Currently, 13 banks are connected to the GHLink platform, implying that customers of these 13 banks can use each other's ATM. This obviously brings a lot of convenience because bank customers will no longer need to go roaming in search of their bank's ATM but could use the next available ATM once the bank is connected to GHLink. The bank's integration into the national switch involves three stages. The first stage is the preliminary testing stage, which involves the testing of the various components of the interfaces of banks uh, to the national switch and they are tested against the required specifications. And once that is successful, they are moved on to the second stage, which is the certification stage. All these components are put together and we test it under certain conditions. And if a bank complies, then they are ready to be moved onto the live system, which is the third stage. It's really true. I can withdraw money from any bank, anywhere, thanks to GH Link. This is what I call convenient. Look, I just got cash from the first ATM I saw on my way to work. And this is not even my bank. It's unbelievable. GH Link linked me right here. <laughs> 
The Ghana Interbank Payment and Settlement Systems, GIPS, since its inception, has developed national electronic payment platforms to facilitate various electronic payments, notably the eSwitch Biometric Payment System, the Check Code Line Clearing with Truncation System, the Ghana Automated Clearing House Systems, and now the GHLink Transaction Switching and Processing System. It is anticipated that all banks in Ghana will be hooked up to GHLink by the end of 2012 to enable bank customers to enjoy the full benefits of the interbank ATM transaction switching service. Banks are going to have more uh, card holders using their ATM than before. So we have two ways. For the banks, they are going to have more customers and for the individuals, there's going to be more convenience for us and together everybody is a winner. In terms of the future, we are going to convert some of the ATMs into a hybrid, a hybrid ATM, and what that would enable it to do, it will allow it to not only accept the local cards that we have in the country, but also accept e-switch cards as well. We are also going to come out with the, a hybrid POS, point of sale device. Currently, majority of the point-of-sale devices in the country only accepts e-switch cards. Once we convert them into a hybrid, these point-of-sale devices will now start accepting all cards in the country. We would also connect our switch towards the end of next year to the French West African countries as well as um, Nigeria. And what that will bring to bear is that um, individual card holders in Ghana will be able to use the ATMs in these countries. We are also going to come out with the, the system that would enable card holders to pay via the web. eGov projects is going to be our first project that we're going to work with to ensure that all government services can be paid for via the web. We will also talk to the airlines, the hotel industry, and indeed some of the supermarkets so that we can start shopping online with our local cards. The days of roaming the whole city or town in search of your bank's ATM are over. The Ghana Interbank Payment and Settlement System, GIPS, has added another positive feature to banking in Ghana. GH Link, powered by GIPS.